So per usual, take all this information with a grain of salt considering it's from Discord insiders. You really never know where they're getting this information from. They could just be trolling us. It's happened so many times in the past. I mean, you guys remember the whole lot of red theories of like, it's dropping on World Music Day and all this shit, but take the information how you will. I feel like it has somewhat merit in that allegedly Kanye is the reason that we do not have Playboy Cardi's album. I am music in 2024 it might not even drop this year but i've been saying that for the longest because you really never know i feel like yes cardi dropped six seven eight singles or a couple features within there but like look what happened with admin that dropped in april 2020 and then a whole lot of red didn't drop until literally the last week of that year and he had been teasing the fans saying that he was dropping in 2019 and then 2020 early and obviously we know how that all went. But so this Discord insider messaged in one of these leak hubs or maybe Playboy Cardi hub claiming that the album was ready to go before Cardi and Kanye linked for 2024, meaning the song that they collabed on. Like it was certain, academics also reported from January, Kanye rocked up for the 2024 shoot and was yapping on about some new radical shit and told Cardi to hold up on the album. So Kanye West, you can suck my dick. <laughs> Which kind of makes sense, because you know how Kanye is very erratic, very sporadic, but that's why he's a musical genius and is still relevant to this day after however many years he's been in the game. So yes, you may not like that he delayed the album, but maybe he had a point with the new direction of Playboy Cardi's album. I mean, he did executive produce a whole lot of res, and a lot of people love that album, even hold it as Playboy Cardi's best album yet, although those are a lot of new fans and so just be patient is all i'm saying maybe kanye's plan is the one kanye 2024 going for president get all these old heads out of the election it's like nah we do not want kanye as president i mean you might i definitely cannot see a world where kanye is the leader of the us but regardless with cardi taking heed of kanye's advice technically they did get a number one song out of it from carnival and then they had another great song fuck some with travis scott as well and i actually like that song more but still we got great songs out of it and cardi's numbers went up and now he's even more prepared to drop and hit you know 100 200k whatever it is that people think that he's gonna sell first week and then with the recent snippets that we already reacted to he already switched it up from the deep voice that it looked like he was going to be using for the album that was practically all the new singles that we got unofficially that is so maybe that was kanye's idea like Maybe you do the deep voice, but don't go all in with every single song on the album having that because it does, in my opinion, get a little bit repetitive. But regardless, we do not know anything about what Kanye specifically said. So let's move on to the next rumor by another Discord insider where allegedly Playboy Cardi has another album coming after I Am Music, and it is titled Baby Boy, which is the nickname that a lot of his crew has been calling him. He's even put it in his Instagram captions. Sex is Death, who is his stylist now, I believe, is calling him that. Opium Baby has called him that many times now. They've placed it strategically and sporadically across social media throughout the last couple of months, so it kind of makes sense, but don't get it twisted. I am not expecting another album, mixtape, whatever, anything music coming after I Am Music for a long time. Last time he dropped was late 2020. And it's almost been four years for this particular album rollout that we're talking about. So I would not expect if you have a healthy mind without any sort of delusion to even be anticipating anything close to another project. Now, will it be a new fashion line or merchandise? Sure, very plausible, but hell no, do I believe that we're getting another project. But to give it a little bit more credibility so it's not just coming from a Discord insider, although this person technically has been one of those for the last couple years, even for the whole lot of red rollout, heaven or hell he has confirmed such information saying i am music and baby boy 2024 on twitter and in discord and clarified to a fan that those are two title names but does that necessarily mean projects no those could just be singles but wait he clarified and said second album is called baby boy first tape is called i am music but y'all let me in the comments what you think is he dropping another project or even if that is in the plans 
is it likely to just be scrapped i feel like baby boy would be cool for like a little ep or mixtape maybe even the deluxe for i am music just to give fans more music since it's been so long maybe it's just a compilation of all the instagram stories of all the music he's previewed or it's all the grails that everybody wants but hasn't heard the full song yet but in addition to that dj academics was streaming last night claiming that he was in possession of one of these new Playboy Cardi leaks that is unheard of, unreleased. Uh, somebody says, play more leaks? Y'all want me to play a Cardi leak? Y'all never heard? Nah, y'all want me to do that. Y'all want me to do that. Actually, Cardi would probably get mad at me. <laughs> Yo, I'll play this Cardi leak. <laughs> and by the way, none of y'all fan pages heard this. Yo, <laughs> I'll play this shit. All of a sudden, Cardi go and post. 2025 music. <laughs> nah, nah, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Now nah, I'm good. Now nah, I'm good. Cardi, one of those people, like, the more you leak his music, you're, you're fucking it up for your damn self. And given that he was premiering the Rick Ross and Drake and Kendrick Lamar tracks on stream to increase all the drama and attention around their beef. And let's not forget that DJ Academics was literally on a song control on Whole Lot of Red. So him and Cardi do have somewhat of a relationship regardless of what Lil 88 says. I could see Cardi sending him some songs or somebody from his team to jumpstart the rollout more than it already has. But for now, that is all the information we have. Potentially two albums. The first one, I Am Music, got delayed because of Kanye, which we kind of already knew because he was dropping Vultures and now Destroy Lonely is dropping and Ken Carson's dropping the Deluxe next month. So it wouldn't make sense for Cardi to drop anyway. And of course, we know the Cardi method where he was dropping with a whole repertoire of larger artists than him so that he can get his monthly listeners up and boost the streams for his next album. It's just mad. But with all that being said, it's been your boy Bob Lamb signing off consistently, giving y'all that cap information about Cardi's albums. Again, let me in the comments how valid or credible you think this information is. Is Cardi dropping two albums? Was his album delayed because of Kanye? Provided to you by these Discord insiders. It's the only thing that we get. Of course, make sure to like and subscribe to the Bob King if you're with it. Peace out, Clive. Nice scene.